there's probably two sides to this story. I think, firstly, I remember having the conversation with Ricky. There was a few of us in the change room. I can't remember if Steve Wall was the captain or Ricky Ponting was the captain at the time. But what the main point of the story is this. What it taught me from a very young age is that Surav Ganguly made it very clear to, as Sachin says, during that period, Australia were very dominant in international cricket. Surav Ganguly made it very clear to Australia and every other team around the world that he wasn't going to be bullied. He wasn't going to accept that anybody was going to tell him what to do. And, you know, I say now, I look at a lot of the young players. I look at Rowett, I look at Virat, I look at a lot of these young guys currently playing for India. And I think they've got that same attitude. And, and I've said it openly, I think Surav deserves a lot of credit for that. The way he was going to take a stance and was going to make sure that that Indian team was going to play their natural game no matter who they were going to play against. Yes, it helped. They had unbelievable talent. The world's greatest batsman, Sachin Tendulkar, Dravid, Laxman, Harbhajan, you know, great attack as well. But I think what he also did, he, he instilled in these players to play fearless cricket. And we all do it differently. You know, some people are more outspoken than, than others. And I remember playing against Sachin and Laxman and Dravid, those three particularly, they would never say a word, but you could see that hunger and that fire inside them by the way they batted or the energy they created on the field. Surav had a different style, but he was very clear that this is my turf, this is how we're going to play. And even though Australia might be the best team in the world, we're not going to back away from you. So, yeah, look, it was. I remember Ricky telling us that, um, like I said, I can't remember if Steve or Ricky was captain at the time. They tossed the coin. Surav said quickly, head tail. Picked up the coin, said, bull bat, thank you very much. Before, <laughs> before Ricky or, or Steve Waugh could even think what had just happened, India's batting, they probably make 500 and Australia loses the game. <laughs>